Hello YouTube and welcome back to another video on the channel and today we are back with some more reaction videos for you guys. Now today we are back with some more like game show quiz show stuff because you guys seem to enjoy these on the channel and today we are back with some sports questions 2019 compilation can you win who wants to be a millionaire now we've reacted to other quiz shows like this before um we've done the chase we've done uh 10 cuts just countdown we've done weakest link we've done sidemen versions of game shows so hopefully you guys enjoy this one if you do want to see more who wants to be in there or any other videos let me know down in the comment section down below and i'll get on to that as soon as possible now today hopefully you guys enjoy this who wants to be a millionaire and let's just get let's just let let's just get on into this and we are back it's about 10 minutes hopefully we can get most of these right because if it's a football bullet question i'll get it right if it's any other sport probably going to get it wrong so let's just roll on into this fifa world cup finals tournament been held the most times africa once south america mm. europe asia it's either b or c I'm pretty sure it's europe i just need to work out so africa it's only been in once in south africa in 2010 asia i think it's been just jeff uh, 2002 um, i think south it's europe america, in Brazil and Argentina. In Mexico twice, but Mexico doesn't count as South America, I don't think. Uh, it's been in Brazil, and the most recent one, but Europe's been in multiple times. Yeah, Europe's France, been England, France, Germany, England. Russia, yeah, I think Spain. It's definitely Europe. <laughs> it's been in all over the place. Yeah, definitely Europe. Well done, you. £64,000. That was a 64k question. I mean, if you don't know football, I guess that's really hard to do. Six and half of them were penalties. <laughs> six. Yeah, six. Eight. Ten. It was six because half of them were penalties. I'm fairly certain I know this. I think I watched all of England's games despite being Welsh, but I think I'd just like to use the 50 50 just to confirm what I've got in my head. Please. Okay, computer, can you take away two wrong answers, please? Six. Yeah, it's definitely six. Yeah, the answer is six, final answer. Well, six, yeah. I'm such a brain box, aren't I, guys? Such a brain box. Yep, you're right. <laughs> oh, you've read it. In football, the 2017-18 Premier League title was won by which club? Man City. Manchester City. Because this season, 1920, Man City won the double back. Manchester United. Manchester City. You have to use 50 -50. I'm guessing the football's not your strongest subject. No, hate it. Okay, right, strong, but there we are. Um, right, I absolutely hate well, it. And you definitely want to use 50 50. Uh, no, I'll ask you. <laughs> that face. You definitely want to ask me. I'm going to ask you. I'm going to ask me. Okay, fine. Here's what I think. Come on, Jeremy. You got this. Right. My son will never speak to me again. 2017 18. Okay, so Chelsea's my team. We haven't won it for ages. United, totally useless. They haven't won it for ages. City are the champions. That was 2017 18 is last year, isn't it? It's City. Manchester City. It's Manchester City. I'm pretty certain of that. Well done, Jeremy. That's my final answer. Well done, Jeremy. Manchester City is the answer. Manchester City, final answer. Trusting you. Okay, computer, can you please reveal the correct answer? I've got them all right so far, but genius. Absolute genius. The Premier League football team Liverpool has a home kit that is predominantly... What are these questions? Colour. Red. Red. Black. If this is not like a 200 cold question. White. Red. That's red. Final answer. You didn't even have to watch freaking right football that match and they're Liverpool red. So Matthew Pinson won there we go. four consecutive Olympic gold medals in which sport? Diving, rowing, boxing, gymnastics. I'd go rowing because to do it in four consecutive years uh, is four, houses eight. In primary school, it's houses was called Pinson, and I'm fairly sure that he's a, a rower, so I'm going to say... 
educated guess rowing because it had to be 16 years for being four consecutive Olympic Games. And that's probably the best. Because because you can't do 16 years of diving in a row. Because most like two or three. Boxing's the same. Gymnastics the same. <laughs> in football, which of these words does not feature in the name of a team in the 2018-19 okay. season of the English Last season. League? Rovers, Ooh. City, Town, United. Singing United, yes. Oh, I should know this immediately. Rovers. I'm a long-suffering Arsenal fan. Um, obviously, United and City, there are lots of. I'm trying to work out who's a town. At the who's moment. a town in the champion uh, in the? Who's a town in the Premier League? Right, you got Arsenal, Aston Villa. No, that was that was the season before. Who went down last season? Huddersfield United, so, uh, Fulham went down, and who the hell was the other one? West Bromwich Albion. So you got, Chef. No, you've got. What Rovers in the Prem in the Premier League? There's Blackburn Rovers, Doncaster Rovers. There's got to be a town. There has to be a town. Huddersfield Town. It was Huddersfield Town, wasn't it? Yeah, it was Rovers. Uh, I think there are no Rovers, because the only Rovers are Blackburn Rovers and... There's one other one, and it's escaping me. Tranmere Rovers. Yeah, it's, it's Rovers. Town for it's Rovers. It's Huddersfield Town. It's not Huddersfield United. It's Huddersfield Town. It's boring to think about, isn't it? Um... <laughs> Rovers. Oh, Huddersfield Town. Okay, so the answer is A, Rovers, final answer. Well worked out. That was good, actually. And you just won £8,000. We are so smart at sport. Which cyclist won the 2018 edition? It's going to go downhill from here, guys. Chris Froome, Geraint Thomas, Bradley Wiggins... Simon Yates. The only one I've heard of is Bradley Wiggins, but Chris Froome rings the bell, so I'm going for A. I'm going for A. What? Chris Froome, he won the Giro d'Italia. Bradley Wiggins has retired. I think Yates, he won the uh, Welter of Spania. And I think Geraint Thomas won the Tour de France. So I'll go Geraint Thomas, final answer. Oh, yeah, my first one I got wrong. Only piece of working out, the right answer. Well done, 4,000 pounds. 4K question. In which sport did Simone Biles win four gold medals. At okay, the so it's got to be an event where you can summer. realistically do four gold medals. Equestrian, a... badminton, gymnastics, or rowing. It has to be gymnastics. I'm pretty certain she's a fantastic American gymnast. So I'll say gymnastics. Because equestrian, I can only think of dressage and. T oh, can I... Sixteen thousand pounds. Yeah. Yours. Because the question hasn't got enough events. Badminton's probably going to got singles doubles. Same with rowing, single double mixed. I don't think of four events in that. Which tennis player won the Wimbledon Ladies? Ah, oh, this is like lot. The year two thousand. Martina Hingis, Lindsay Davenport, Serena Williams, or Venus Williams. Oh, it's one of the Williams. It's one of the Williams, but I don't know which one. But Serena. Really got much of a clue on this one. Isn't Serena the better one? So I will go 50 50 because I might as well. Okay, computer, can we it, if it leads C and D. Answers, oh, it's. Oh, I was wrong. I'll still go for one lifeline remaining, of course. Yes. Well, before I talk through any thinking, I will. I'll ask the audience. Oh, good idea. I want to steer them. Okay, audience, um, on your keypads, please, and let's please take this seriously, all of you, um, because we really do want to try and get Christopher up to half a million quid here. So really think this through. This is a you vote. big money question. Um, this is the question: Which tennis player won the Wimbledon Ladies Singles title in the year 2000? If you think it's Lindsay Davenport, I think it's D out of those two. If you think it's Venus Williams, push D. 
Okay, all vote now, please. I love how they still got A and C on the dashboard. If someone puts A or C, they're an idiot. Neither have I. Venus Williams is around about, what, like 37, 38 now, so she would have been 20 ish. It's definitely plausible that she could have. Yeah, I'll go Venus. I'll go Venus. £186,000 is what's at stake if you. Oh, that's a lot. That is a lot of money. That could. Imagine the stuff you could do with 186k. You know what? I don't think I can risk that kind of money on something that I'm not... I don't have anything more than the vaguest inkling about. So I am going to... Walk away. Take the money. Final answer. Well done. Safe play. Okay. Um, we've all got to know. Had you gone for it, what would you have said? Had I gone for it, I would have said Venus Williams. Well, um, Lindsay Davenport was in the 2000 final, and she lost to Venus Williams. Oh! Listen. Madness. That was, yeah. So, that was the reaction to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire sports questions. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you smash the like button down below, be subscribed if you're new around here, and do enjoy the content. As always, leave any suggestions of any other videos you want me to react to in the comment section down below. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!